the way this kind of got away quickly, do you chalk this up to maybe guys' minds were already in the All-Star break even before you hit the All-Star break? Or um, No, not not really. Um, I think there's a lot that just kind of came with tonight. Um, you know, I think effort for us, you know, especially defensively, I think we didn't have that effort, you know. You know, whatever the game plan we had up there, I think we just execute it as we should. And um, but then again, it's just it's difficult. It's tough. Um, just the scheme sometimes just you know, being in mismatches a lot, you know, switching everything. And then offensively, then again, it's tough again because a guy like Ben who plays and is not here today, it's a different dynamic when he has it. You know what I'm saying? And it's, um, I mean, Nobody plays or guards been like anybody else really on our team unless it's a big and Ben has it a lot. And even when we have been, it's not really um, a super offense we're running. It's like he gets it, goes, and we kind of play off him and, you know, guys back up so he could dribble and then dribble handoff and stuff like that. But we don't have him out here. So it's kind of like we can't play like that. We can still play fast, but kind of get us in sets and do stuff, and I think we didn't have that tonight. As far as just the effort, I mean, what do you think that was attributed to? Was it just Boston being able to drain it slowly or just things that you guys could control a little bit? I mean, just effort. I think just the effort, we have to, we control that. I mean, that's, that's the biggest part. Um, like I said, like whatever the game plan was, I think we have to do that with effort, and we didn't have that, especially in the beginning. And they ran up, and then offensively, like I said, we if you don't know what we're doing offensively, then the offense looks bad, and now they're getting out of transition, and now they're going to keep scoring. We're trying to, you know, especially without no, the effort we have, they're going to keep scoring, and then they're going to keep getting stops because it's just like, I mean, you guys watch the game, it's like, like you're probably sitting there like, what the hell is going on, this and that. So it's tough, but definitely the effort with the defense, you know, starts with that. You almost need a... A with game, a with Ben game plan, and without Ben game plan, I and mean, he's so influential for how you guys want to play. I mean, for sure. I mean, it's and that's it's like having a, obviously it's extreme, but it's, it's like say you got Philly with Ben. I mean, with um with Joel. Like when he's not playing, you don't play the same style, and so it's like it's a you got to know how we play with that and and stuff like that. How much of it is you know. Things are still new. Things are still new with Schroeder too. Guys are still learning how to play with Schroeder. Guys are still learning how to play. I guess just this new scheme. I guess with Jock. How much of that do you think is part of the the difficulty with the picking things up and executing? Yeah, I mean that's tough too. Just with with Dennis, you know, coming here, um, and then because well, he didn't start last game and being in the lineup, it's you know he doesn't know what we're in. You know he's new. He doesn't know what we're in, and, and he has the ball so. It's tough as well, not knowing what we're doing and kind of running around. And, and I thought, you know, you play a team like Boston, you can't just be freestyling. You know, they're, they're a really good team and they detail to on both ends to the highest level because that's where they're at. And you can't just run around and with, with a, reach like a chicken with your head cut off. You got to have stuff, you know, prepare for them and what we're running and all that. And like I said, it's tough for Dennis because he hasn't been here. So it's like, he doesn't know, and then kind of go off that, and now we're running around, space is bad, and then it goes from there. How do you, I mean, you guys only get, I mean, so you have the break. Yeah. You only get, I mean, you got a full practice, I guess, before you start that yeah. road trip, maybe a light practice before that. How do you accelerate that process of, you know, getting the new guy, a new guy who's got the ball in his hands, yeah. on the same page with everybody? How do you accelerate that process? I mean, we got to we gotta know what we're doing. We got to come as a team with coaches and, and figure out a game plan and can't be the same with everybody. Can't be the same, it's everybody, everybody's different. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, with Ben out there, it's a different, he could dribble hand off and stop because how teams guard him. You know, we can't, we got four guards out there. With Clax, it's a different game. So just kind of know how to play that way and, and just off that. The last two, two months or so have just been kind of a, a tough stretch for you guys. So how do you not let this sink in and linger after the break, where you guys obviously are now trying to fight for this playing spot. Um, yeah, I mean, you got to learn and then if, if, if fix the issue. That's pretty much what it is. You can't just let this one go and think, like, oh, like, let it drop. Like, no, like, yeah, maybe if you 
maybe lost towards the end, but you got beat by 50. It's not just let it go. A lot of is is not right, and you got to fix it.